Good morning, year two. A big hello from me on this lovely sunny morning. And I know that Mrs. King and Mrs. Belcher and all of the year two team would also be wanting to say a big hello to you too. We are missing you so much and it feels so strange not to be at East Park every day with you. So during this video, I'm going to be sharing some learning that we hope that you will enjoy doing at home. The first is a bit of English. Now we know at the moment that we're all being asked to stay indoors and keep ourselves safe. And one of the biggest messages that we keep hearing from not only Boris, but even from our very own Miss Guest during her video earlier this week, we know we've got to make sure that we are washing our hands. So your English this week is to write a set of instructions on how to wash your hands properly during this very important time. So my advice is actually wash your own hands first. Do it and then think about each of the steps that you needed to do to make sure that your hands are really clean. Once you know all of the steps, have a go then at writing each step really clearly. You could even use our time words such as first, after that, next, to really make your instructions clear. Then, once you've written them, make sure you share them with all of your family who are in your house so that they are washing their hands too. So that's job one. Write a set of instructions on how to wash your hands. Second, some maths for you while you are at home. We know that in year two, learning our times tables is really important. So we want to make sure that you are practising your counting of two, five, ten, and three, that's always our tricky one. So practice lots, just counting like this. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. And practicing being able to do that as fast as you can really does help. And then you can ask someone in your family to ask you a quick times table question. For example, five multiplied by two, and you can get your five fingers and count in twos. Two, four, six, eight, ten, and there's your answer. Practice that as much as you can. Also this week, we have a maths puzzle for you. Now, this is on the sheet that you will also be able to see, but you are going to be given four numbers. You've got a two, a three, an eight, and a four. And your challenge is to make the totals that are on your sheet. So I think the first one is to make nine. So you have to look at the numbers and see if you can find one or two or three numbers to add together to make the total of nine. There are lots of different totals for you to work through, so try your best and don't give up. Don't forget our East Park Aid of Perseverance to help you with your maths. Last of all, we want you to be thinking about some science. Now, the weather is lovely at the moment, and in, in our class, we've been learning all about plants. What we would like you to do, now if you have a garden, you can do this in your garden, or when you go out for your once a day walk that you're allowed to do, maybe you could look and see what plants you can see and go on a bit of a plant hunt. If you spot any plants that you really like the look of, you could even take a little sketch of them and then have a little look what they look like. As part of our learning as well, we would also like you to do a little bit of research on the internet. There are some, some web links on the sheet for you to see if you can find out all about the life cycle of a plant. So that would be really good if you could do that. And then once you've done that bit of learning, you could then create a poster with all of the learning that you have done. So you've got English, you've got some maths, and you've got some science. And also don't forget every morning at nine o'clock, you can tune in to PE with Joe on YouTube. I've been trying it with my children and my goodness me, it keeps you very, very fit. Anyway, year two, we miss you. Enjoy your learning and don't forget if you've got any fantastic photos of learning that you are doing at home, please email over to year2parents at eastparkacademy.com. I've already had about 10 emails from you and your families showing the learning that is taking place and it makes me feel so happy to see you learning at home. So have fun, stay safe and we'll see you this time next week. Bye everybody in year two.